YouTube surprises it all by removing live subscriber counts for Korea, at least for channels with over 1,000 subscribers. And many people got actually mad at YouTube for this because maybe they used live subscriber counts in their videos or streams, something like that. And that's why I'm gonna show you guys today how to get a live subscriber count on your OBS Studio. That is very easy, and if it helps, then please uh, like, please leave a like on the video, and maybe consider subscribing to not miss a single video that I upload. That would be very, that would be very much. Now let's get into it. So the first thing you want to do is open up Google, and it has to be Google, not Google, not Internet Explorer or uh, Microsoft Edge. It has to be Google Chrome, and that is because you'll have to download a Google Chrome extension later on, and uh, you'll see which one in just a minute. So you want to search for Social Blade Google Chrome extension, and I, if you don't want to search for it, I'll leave a link almost in the top of the description so you can just go to the website in one click. If you search for it, you want to click on Social Blade dash Google Chrome. Now before I do anything more, I just want to say that Social Blade is a YouTube verified company with many millions and millions of users, not just on the Google extensions but the website too, and it is uh, known worldwide. So. The, it won't give you any viruses, it is totally safe to use. Now with that said, you want to click on add and then add again. It is in Swedish, sorry by the way. Now when you now when you come to this page, so the Social Blade extension is, is added to your Google Chrome. You can log into your Social Blade account if you have one, but, yeah, but I'm going to do this in the video. You, you are you can, free to close these pages that are up here. But I'm gonna leave them open for it now. Now, when you know that you have Social Blades Google extension downloaded on your PC, you want to go to your YouTube analytics and make sure that you are logged into the YouTube account whose live subscriber count you want to be shown on your live stream, basically. So go to youtube.com slash dashboard while you are logged into your account that you want to be logged into. And you come here to your, obviously, the YouTube analytics and one th and change that you should see and notice here is that there is a tab here that says live subscriber count and this is from the uh, social blade ex extension click on that and you should see your live subscriber count now to show you guys that this actually is live i'm going to hop onto my alt account on on my phone and unsubscribe to the channel so let's do it like this and boom, it goes down from 41 to 42, and if I subscribe back, it goes to 42. Now it takes like 10 seconds or something for it to update, but uh, that's just how it is. You have, you'll have to live with it, sorry. Alright, so now that I've showed you guys that it, that it, this is actually a legit live subscriber account, I'm going to show you how to add this to your OBS Studio. So let's click on the streamer mode that you see here. Then there will be your live subscriber count and a green screen in the background. And it is very important that you have it this this window up here with this live subscriber count and the green screen up. You want to have this open. Do not close this whenever you're live. You need to have this up. So when you when you have your green screen, the live subscriber count, you want to go over to the OBS Studio, hit that source plus button, and select the window capture. Okay, you can name it whatever you want. Let's do a so social blade countdown, something like this. I am not sure. You can name it whatever you want. Okay, and select this here. Chrome.exe live subscriber count social blade user studio. I go go Chrome. You get what I mean. Select this. Okay, and crop it. Like I just I'm gonna crop it so it fits the screen right now. And um, okay, like this. And what you want to do is hold Alt and drag, crop and drag like this. So you only see the live subscriber count and also so this text under here disappears. So I mean this looks fine for me actually. And if it, and once, once you are done with your cropping and stuff like that, you want to go down to your source, uh, your social blade countdown as it, as it is named for me. Right click it, filters and add a filter. Now click on chroma key. Uh, don't name it anything just and click on ok the color type select green and then the background should be transparent there we go here we have my live subscriber count and uh, as uh, and you can try yourself that it works by subscribing and unsubscribing or telling someone something you know to subscribe and unsubscribe just to check that this live subscriber count works and i re just realized that sometimes if you close and open obs it might glitch a bit this this thing so if if for some reason the sub account is gone or glitched then d just remove it and do the same process again 
and your live subscriber count will be back just like it was before. I'm not sure if this is the only way to get a live subscriber count, but but maybe it is. I don't know. At least it for sure is the only way to get a green screen live subscriber count. So I hope this helped, guys. If it did, then please make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video and consider subscribing to the channel. So now this is a single upload that I make. That would mean very much. Thank you very much for watching this video. See you next video. Peace.